Okay, and the next one on our assignment is to do macro photography. Now, macro photography means close-up photography. It's mostly done with plants and insects, but really getting in there close. When I was taking a picture of the little Lego minifig, that was almost macro photography. Now, some older iPads can't focus very close to things, but some of the newer ones really can focus close. And so I've got a newer one here, and I'm going to just go ahead and compose this. I want this flower to fill this entire shot here and let it focus in. Sometimes you got to tap it on someplace you want it to focus. Not tap and hold, just tap. Okay, it is so focused, I can see actually the, the threads on this fake flower. So let me just go ahead and snap that shot. There we go, maybe this one up here. This flower, look at how close I can get, let it catch its focus. Oh, it's having a hard time focusing, there we go. Come on, tap it in there, see? That's called tap to focus, when you just tap on it, it will then focus, and let's go with maybe this guy right here. Oh, that's a nice shot right there. Get nice and close. Try to get as close as you can and have that iPad still hold focus on it. Sometimes can't be that close. There we go. That's good. There we go. So get a macro shot of something in the room. If you've got flowers, great. Take flowers or something you can get a really close-up shot of.